and welcome to Home Alchemy. Today we'll be making benzoic acid by the oxidation of toluene by potassium permanganate. For this experiment you will need toluene. You can get this in the paint section of the hardware store. Here we have a one liter can from Ace Hardware Store. It's listed as 100% but it may have some impurities. But for our purpose it's fine. You will also need potassium permanganate. You can find potassium permanganate in the water purification section of some hardware stores. Here's five pounds of it from Menards. You will also need hydrochloric acid. You can get this at, al at almost any hardware store under the old name of muriatic acid, which is basically 31.45% concentration of hydrochloric acid. And finally, you will need some type of a reflux setup. What is a reflux setup? A reflux setup consists of a reaction vessel, like this round bottom boiling glass, and a reflux condenser, with water going into the water jacket and going out the top water jacket. Okay, let's get started! First, pour into a 1,000 milliliter round bottom flask about 500 milliliters of distilled water. Next, add 30 around 30 grams of potassium permanganate to the round bottom flask and swirl to dissolve as much as possible. Whoa! That's awesome, eh? Next, add about 50 milliliters of toluene into the potassium permanganate solution. Don't you like that purple color? Next, place the round bottom flask into a heating mantle and clamp the flask in place. Attach the reflux condenser to the round bottom flask and clamp it gently in place. Okay, we are now ready to begin the reaction. First, add some boiling chips to the reflux condenser, as I'm doing here. Connect the hoses to the water jacket of the reflux condenser. The reflux condenser works kind of like a water cycle. The water starts here and it moves through this tube into the bottom water jacket and it goes up those coil and down the water jacket back into the bucket and it keeps circulating. Now we're going to turn on the water pump. 